What about Yelp? Yelp shows up uh, really high in a lot of search results, especially for branded search or for uh, geographic terms. Um, what, what do we say about Yelp? Yeah, Yelp's been difficult. It definitely has been a struggle for a lot of businesses, especially local businesses with a local audience, because um, it really can hurt businesses. Yelp has their own review algorithm. So what makes it different from other platforms is that you can have five, 10 positive glowing reviews, but Yelp can say, we don't recommend these reviews, mainly because the reviewers are probably first time reviewers. They mm -hmm. just made an account with Yelp. So they actually hide those reviews and it's not even counted mm -hmm. towards your star rating. So if you scroll all the way down to the bottom of the listing, there's a tiny little link that says, you know, view more reviews that weren't recommended by us. Mm -hmm. You can then read them there, but one, no one's gonna even know that those exist. And mm -hmm. two, they don't affect your rating. Um, so if you have one negative review, that can be what's populated. Mm -hmm. And Yelp ranks really well on Google. So mm -hmm. what can happen is you do a search of your business you all of a sudden see that right under your website, you may have Yelp showing and it's populating a one star review. Um, so what's difficult for a company is that you can't necessarily ask for a review on Yelp. You can't, so, yeah. So yeah, yeah, you get five stars isn't even allowed because mm -hmm. it goes against Yelp review policy to ask for reviews. They feel that that's not authentic. So um, you definitely have to take a very, specific thought out approach. If Yelp feels that there's any way that this company's asking for reviews, they'll actually flag the profile, um, penalizing you for it, mm -hmm. saying that they have detected um, that you are populating reviews that aren't true. Mm -hmm. So it seems as though Yelp really prioritizes uh, reviews from their own active community and tend to devalue and even hide reviews from first time users. Mm -hmm. So it'd probably be important to, um, if you're trying to get more reviews there, maybe identify active Yelp users that are also your customers or past customers. Right, yep. And even after that, it might just be time that you recognize Yelp isn't going to be a platform that you're gonna succeed on. So mm -hmm. really focus on other channels like Google and mm -hmm. Facebook where you can be pushing um, positive reviews and just kind of helping to bury that Yelp review that mm -hmm. might be populating on the first page.